I saw it out in the distance. Just the lightest little, not little, but like out there. Oh my god, what the fuck is that? We're gonna die. We're gonna fucking die. Ah! Holy shit! What the fuck? Oh my fucking god. Holy shit! Alright, well, no sense of putting a beak in there unless you just say, don't ever fucking go there again! That was impeccable. Oh my fucking god. Oh, 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 No! Called failure is not the falling down, but the staying down. Mary Pickford. It's time for the next game, I think. <laughs> oh. oh, my man tit hurts. Oh. <laughs> It's so fucking big. like a staircase here oh fuck me what the fuck dude are you for fucking real i'm trying to play the fucking game here Not helpful. God, this is not okay. <laughs> oh my god!
person in game like model because we only have like four or five of them they're working on building out some more so that way it's a bit more uh, variety and they're trying to build out more haunting events and so on and so forth but they're just uh it's taking them a bit because they have to get bugged Ooh, She's right behind me. Oh, her feet are thumping. Her feet are thumping. I don't like it. Yes! She got me. Oh, shit. Shit! Jesus. These pictures keep... Hi. Hello, everybody. Welcome in. Uh, it's actually Wednesday. I think it's Wednesday. Things are confusing. I'm pretty sure it's a Wednesday. And it's already very late. It's, we're starting like an hour late. Um, my apologies on that. Tonight was a busy, busy evening. It is Wednesday, my dudes. <gasps> God, I need to have that on Wednesdays. I just have that fucking stupid meme at the start of every stream. <laughs> it is an idea. Um, so I was spending some time earlier and unfortunately couldn't really get it going. Um, cause I think it's going to take a bit more of a bigger change, but, uh, I am determined to get, um, <coughs> excuse me. I'm determined to get, uh, every single source of audio into its own channel and, and, uh, my OBS here. So that way I'm able to say like, Hey, the, all of these audio pieces, like get captured by Twitch's VOD system, but I can do my, my title player, which is, you know, I, I use for music streaming. I can sit there and play music like we did last night. You guys will hear it on stream, but it won't show up in the VOD. So that way I don't worry about DMCA stuff down the line. Point Redemption only available once on Wednesdays, please. <laughs> um... So it's going to involve me basically making a bunch of changes to my audio setup as it is because I already kind of have some things separated, but not a lot. It's like groups of things. Um, so I need to get that done at some point because last night was lots of fun. Just sitting, I mean, it was, I mean, granted, we were playing Vampire Survivors. So it wasn't like it was like a, a real horror game or anything like that. Um, but it was cool to just kind of chill and, and relax and listen to some music. Last night was great. Yeah. And um, it's cool, too, because we could start off, like, streams and, like, listen to a song or two or something. And, you know, during breaks of having to eat hot sauce, which, don't worry. Uh, I know there's quite a big number up there. I don't know why it's that much lower than what it needs to be, but that's fine. Let me just, let me just fix that. Let me, let me just fix that. One, one second. 
Would you motherfucker? Go oh, down there. There we go. Okay. Sorry, that was bothering me. Uh, <clears throat> I had a great time, Sean. Yes, thank you. And I, I'm glad both of you really enjoyed it. Um, I'm going to do some hot sauces. But first, say it was Wednesday. There was no um, highlight video this week. Because this weekend with On Call was shit. So I'm going to instead... Figure how I can do this without causing absolute fucking mayhem. <clears throat> Excuse me. There we go. Okay, so I made a deal that I'd be doing one highlight video a week. Because uh, I have so much shit that I have to go through. Excuse me. And edit and upload. Because I, I, I want to make it so that... Sure, there's clips. Or as they call them on YouTube, shorts. Cool. We have our VODs that go there for people that want to watch the full episodes and see what happens. Cool. Can do. What about in the middle? There's people that want to see your clips but strung together see kind of the best of par parts of different streams uh so i'm hoping that i can stay on top of that moving forward i've done like two or three in a row unfortunately i missed when i miss i actually have to gift a sub to the community so for that i'm going to randomly gift a sub I went to Myth Drago. Okay. <laughs> I don't know who that is. I can't recall. But that's that. And that also makes things very, very difficult. I don't know why it didn't play the noise, but that that's a divi that's divisible by three now. So I now 15, six hot sauces I owe. Six. Fuck. Um, great. Awesome. Not a fucking problem. One eternity later. So maybe we'll start off with some hot sauces here. Uh, why don't we do three of them today? Um, just to kind of chisel away at this. And then maybe I'll do another three tomorrow. Seeing how I feel. Uh, so without further ado. Let's spin that motherfucking wheel. Or not. I need Soma here to do spin 12. <laughs> First one is number six. <laughs> God damn it. Where is Bird? Oh, speaking of Bird, he comes into Discord today and he's like, you need to play Inscription. Uh, is it Inscriptum? Inscription? Uh, it's a horror-based deck building game. And I'm like, yeah, it's on my wish list. I'm keeping an eye on it. You know, blah, 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 blah. I'll play it eventually. And the fucker just gifts it to me. Bastard. I was chatting with him earlier today. Oh, good. Well, he was playing some Moonster Hunt. Nice. 13. Oh, that was so fucking close. Ooh. Okay. There's 13, which is Bat Country. 1L Papatronian. <laughs> and one more to go. I don't like doing double shots. That's That's dumb. One more. It's going to land on 12, not going to hate my life. No, 20. <laughs> it should be 20 because I just saw it. Yep. Oh, it's the garlic maroga. Fuck. <laughs> the 
this one's hot and I have only had it a couple times. <laughs> okay. What was 13 called? <laughs> 13 is called Bat Country. Get over there. Jesus. It's, it's such a struggle. Like, or maybe it's just my problem. But... I go from, you had that garlic one last night, yeah? This is a different one. So that one was the garlic, um, that's the garlic, like, Carolina Reaper one. Like the AX7 song. No, <laughs> you know, Tree, I know what you're doing, and I'm not falling for your troll. So this one is very similar, because it's, it's slowly cooked in garlic confit, which I'm like, I didn't realize garlic had fat, but okay. Um, it's garlic, mortuga, scorpion mash, avocado oil, white wine vinegar, water, fresh lime juice and zest, toasted mustard seeds, spices. Very hot. It's the same thing as the garlic Carolina Reaper. It's just the mortuga, scorpion peppers instead. Which, depending on who you ask, some people think scorpion peppers are hotter. Some people think reapers are hotter. Um, I think technically the Scoville unit... Carolina Reaper is a little bit hotter. Can't you help me in the do -do -do -boo -do -do -do. <laughs> My word. Yes. Oh, did I just do that just so he can make a clip? Son of a bitch. Too many Scovels and I'm starting to get in the trap. God damn it, Spore. <laughs> <laughs> That's fucking funny. Oh, shit. All right, before I continue with that, I'm going to do it now. Um, I need to reset the counter, and I'm going to add nine, which is the other three. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Now it's going to play. Oh, God, here yep. it comes. Fucking assholes. Great. Number six is first. I forgot I expanded the uh, the camera My in this God. scene. Must be over a hundred. Kind of moved tourists. some stuff around. Dad, are you all right? Yeah. Eventually. No, I'm good. But I'm gonna have. Feel it's not. Better. It won't work. God damn it, tree. Some fucking times. Um. Once we move over to playing music through title, and I'm streaming it through. Um. I'm gonna have a now playing thing right up here. Uh. So yeah, so I was testing it earlier. You could see above what I was listening to. Uh, so that will be able to be there. It's going to update as I, you know, a song go, it goes from song to song. So we'll know what's coming. Uh, but that's not going to be happening tonight. So I'm just going to hide that. But I wanted to give you a little sneak peek on some stuff I've been working on. That's the problem with streaming, I think. I can't just be done with a setup and a configuration I'm consistently looking to change things, make it look nicer, round stuff out, make it easier on me, make it more interactive for all of you. Like there's just, there's always something. It's like going in a fucking house. Anyways, number six is going in. <laughs> ah. These mini hot sauces fucking blow. Oh. <laughs> like, at first, I was like, okay, like, these make sense. These are fine. They're better. They're better than the jelly beans. And I get these real hot sauces. And I'm like, oh, no. Fucking great clip. I love it. Great. Thanks. You guys are really good friends. So, uh... Yeah, here we are. Bat country. For a reminder for anyone that hasn't seen this one yet. This one is rated hot, so a step down from very hot. Uh, fire roasted tomatoes, habanero chilies, carrots, roasted onion, garlic, brown sugar, mustard, vinegar, spices. I'm bad. I'm a baddest motherfucker in the world. Oh shit. My dude, how have you been? I know who you are. 
The Bogmeister. Bog, how are you doing, man? Welcome in. Gifting a sub to Joven. Joven's going to appreciate that. Thank you so much, man. Perfect timing we're doing hot sauces. All right. So, yeah, here goes uh, Bat Country. Lots of tomato in the front. Brown sugar. Very delicious. A little bit of garlic there, yeah. Ooh, the habanero burn is really nice. Yeah, I keep bringing this one is actually like significantly like a very good hot sauce. <laughs> Took all the bad flavor in my mouth from the last one. Ooh, perfect time. I got new hot sauces for myself last week. Ooh, do tell, do tell. I got these ones here. Um, you can probably find them on Facebook now. I think it goes by Gonzo Sauce. But they're, it's the emblem says Fear and Loathing in Scoville, which is hysterical. Uh, but they're from Rochester, New York. He doesn't have, it's weird because he doesn't have a web page yet. He's still relatively new. Um, he has some, he's really good stuff on there. So yes, this is the Garlic Moruga. This one is a Scorcher. For those who missed it, it's Garlic Moruga Scorpion Mash, Avocado Oil, White Wine Vinegar, Water, Fresh Lime Juice and Zest, Toasted Mustard Seeds and Spices. And it's rated very hot. Might die. Lots and lots of lime. Okay, it's down. By the time I come back up from putting this in the fridge, my lips are gonna be on fire. Yeah, there it is. Oh my God. Oh. Ooh, wash that shit down. Oh. Oh. Oh my God. Jesus Christ. Well, while I'm recovering here, uh, for those who haven't been around in a minute or they haven't been here during the month of October, we celebrate Jugtober around here every October. Some information there about how we're raising funds for uh, hope for the day. You can see our progress up above in the blue. Uh, if you're interested in making a donation, there's a link in the chat that just popped up or scroll down You will see a little widget down there a little panel if you will uh, They'd help you donate right there right in the uh, in the stream. So you don't have to go anywhere. Oh my god uh -uh. Uh, So we raised money for hope for the day. We also did this last year uh, Hope for the Day is uh, an organization that fights uh, for suicide prevention and awareness. Uh, something that's very uh, close and dear to my heart, as it is to, I'm sure, many other people that are in this stream and really around the world. Uh, so last year we raised over $1,400. This year we are at $631. It's doing really good. The goal this year is a bit higher because last year we almost, we almost hit the, the final goal and I figured, hey, let's go to, the, go to the moon, baby. So everything, everything from subs to bits, uh, jump scare bits and all that stuff, all of that is, um, uh, the proceeds that I get after Twitch takes their cuts and all that shit, excuse me. That goes in. Oh, you know what I didn't do? Uh, other than not die. I never actually... Um, I never added in the funds from last stream. Shit. That's okay. Um... <clears throat> 
You know what I'll do? I will add one big bundle in there after this stream. Everything from last night and today. Ghoul re-released their brain jerk sauce. I got goat whore and Fu Man Chu sauce from Texas Hot Sauce. Plus a barbecue orange sauce I put on wings already and Metal Blade and Revocation put out sauces as well so I couldn't resist. Damn, dude. I didn't realize so many fucking bands and shit had <laughs> hot sauces out. <coughs> Fuck. Wrong pipe. Thank you. And um, outside of Jugtober, there's one other thing we also launched with Jugtober, and that's the new merch store. <coughs> Unfortunately, because I keep uh, I keep the profits extremely minimized, so I don't have to keep I don't have to have a higher price for everything. They're as low as possible. Um, I'm not gonna have the proceeds go to on this because it's like you're gonna spend like $35 on a hoodie and like I think three of those dollars comes to me so I just feel like it'd be silly to be like yeah here this is how much you're gonna actually give to charity from these purchases like I so I'm just like you know what something that's fun if you're interested go for it <clears throat> There's also gift options in there too if you want to gift something to the stream, which we've seen before. Um <clears throat> dude, it's nuts. Yeah, for real. <sighs> ah. My god. Okay. <clears throat> Excuse me. Um, I just realized I never <clears throat> I never set this up properly. <clears throat> there we go. All right. So, tonight, uh, what other news do we have? Anything news-oriented? I don't believe so. Tonight's my last night at On Call for, until hopefully December, which is going to be great. <clears throat> um, so, yeah, so hopefully, hopefully everything goes smooth sailing this evening. Um, again, Jugtober is rolling along. We have on Friday at 10 o'clock, I'm gonna be finalizing some things tomorrow <coughs> with some uh, some other streamers, but also, but basically we're gonna have other people, like anyone from the community that wants to play, we're gonna be having an Among Us community stream uh, Friday night starting at 10 p.m. Eastern. Um, I know myself, well, obviously I'm gonna be here. Um, Polish was very interested, Doc Isles was interested, uh, Heavy Hand Swings, um, <coughs> Uh, Noxler, Candy Marsh. Um, there's a bunch of I gotta go through, but we're gonna have a stacked fucking house. Um, so we're gonna do that Friday night. Saturday night, starting at 8 p.m. Eastern Standard Time, uh, is gonna be our creature double feature. We're starting off with the Night of the Living Dead, and then <clears throat> we roll into the second movie, which is Killer Clowns from Outer Space. Uh, so the channel will be live um, However It's just gonna be basically saying like hey Go join discord. We're gonna be in discord streaming there just because I don't want to get DMCA while I'm trying to You know play a movie for you guys night uh, the night of the living dead is technically DMCA free because it is uh it Is uh, public domain but uh killer clowns from outer space is not so, I just want to make sure that where I, I, I get better at following those rules. In the same way, if I want to play like legitimate music, um, it'll work on the stream, but I don't want to have it carry over to the VOD because that causes problems. People don't like that. So, uh, I think it's really all I got for updates so far. Ugh. Um, we are getting pretty close to um, I think so. At 650, it's the Hot Wheels Spin X2, but after that, at the $700 mark, is the Fall Guys community stream. Uh, that game rattles me, so uh, that should be fun if we get there. Uh, and then, 
of course, so I obviously have, there's been a few streams I haven't been able to do in the first half of Jugtober, and a week from today, I'm going to be in Maine for like an extended like weekend for a wedding. Uh, so it's going to be a, pre quite a few nights where it's just not, just, I won't be here. So I'm going to end up extending Jugtober into November. Um, just so we can make sure we get a, a fair, you know, crack at it. Um, Cause it'd be kind of silly to be like, it's only October and it was like 12 streams. Like I want to make sure that anyone that's able to, to give to this in any way, shape or form gets their chance. And, uh, <clears throat> and that we get the most prizes out of this too, because it's, it's super goofy. Um, some of the things that are on there for sure. Um, I think it's enough, enough, uh, enough news for tonight tonight so i think we're gonna go ahead and jump into our game our game tonight is called project nightmares um case 36 henrietta kedward <clears throat> so i don't really know much about this game i think i may have seen like on same tbd's youtube channel like oh, last year i think there was a jump scare that came up and someone had i was like oh i haven't even heard of this before um, but, uh, yeah, I mean, it's, it seems, I, I read the reviews, it seems like it's, it's pretty decent, so I figured we'd give it a shot. My banned hot sauce collection is far too many, it has Cannibal Corpse, DSI, Axe Slasher, Cataclysm, Red Fang, The Sword, Municipal Waste, I Hate God, Sick of It All, and a few more if I went and looked in my fridge. Damn, you, uh, you don't really have to worry about, uh, having hot sauce for any fucking meal then that's awesome is it the shoes thanks for the lurk my dude hope you're doing well um i saw it was uh it was the lady shoes birthday the other day happy bladed to her the goat horse sauce is so good oh damn i guess i'm missing out i need to get this hot sauce and then i can Ooh. Ooh. uh okay I am ready to play uh, somebody's here. Shit. We'll see what we got going on over here. This baby's head follows the mouse. I hate it. Okay. Um, <clears throat> also, we want, uh, no drop frames or anything, so that's good. You'll love to see it. All right. What do we got? What's going on with this game? Justin NL01, thank you so much for the follow. Welcome to the mob. How'd you find us here today? Just out of curiosity. Great, I wish I tried the high on fire one by the same guy. Oh, Jesus. So we're in some type of underwater tank. Well done. Let's start. Communication ready? Move your head if you can hear me. No. Perfect. I'm going to guide you so you can understand everything. You're currently inside Hypno. Thanks to this machine, we can achieve the perfect connection between a patient and an evil object. Everything we know about Case 36 has to do with Henrietta Kedwin. Okay. Apparently, she was the evil old woman in the temple. I her see. was buried very well. Project <coughs> Nightmare's team found a mysterious doll with a strong malignant energy in a town that ceased to exist long ago. Jesus. Remember, your mission is to find a way to clear out this energy. The dream will give you a connection with his past, so we can understand its history, what happened, and how to end the evil. Huh. Be very careful. The evil entity will find many ways to kill you. Of course. And as you go deeper and get closer to it, it will become even more dangerous. All right. Let's start phase one. I don't remember signing up for this job. You're going to start feeling sleepy, so just let yourself go. No, I'm all set. I'm going to stay awake. Thanks. Yeah, with that light flashing in my eyes, I'm not going to be falling asleep anytime soon. Thanks, though. Oh, God. Oh, I'm going to flash banged. You going to Chats Bronx or Gwar next week? 
quote, sleep, quote, sleep, quote, sleep, quote, sleep, quote, sleep, quote, sleep. Everything we know about Casey is centers around the figure of Henry Kedward. Apparently, she was an ill-tempered hermit whom the townsfolk have voted at all costs. But most other information about her is gone, as if it's been intentionally buried. The Project Nightmares team attracted a mysterious doll emitting a strong malignant energy that it seems linked to Kedward. The store clerk who turned the doll over to our team told him that he found it in an abandoned town in the south. Great. Now I wish. Next show is Merciful Fate. Uh, same here, dude. It's going to be awesome. Can, I cannot fucking wait for that. Okay. Wow. Everything looks so real. So real. You're already inside. Maintaining prolonged dialogue between us breaks the circle of communication. You'll be alone most of the time. Oh, nice. But we will guide you. I'm excited to see you, dude. I haven't seen you in a fucking minute. Good luck. Gather information about the house. Find three photos. Find the four lost masks in the house. Candles. Candles have been used to light one's way since ancient times. The witches of ages past discovered that the color of a candle's wax alters the spiritual energy its light em emits. The yellow candle has a very useful light for protection against evil entities. Light an unlit candle with another in order to help protect yourself. X to see how many candles I have. I guess I have one. Yep, I have one. Great. I hate it already. What's this? Henry Kedward's diary. Confession. For those who who read this, this is my confession. Maybe with time you can understand what happened to my life. I will try to explain everything. Since my adolescence, I felt that I was different from the others. At an early age, I discovered that certain subjects were forbidden to ordinary people, more so for a woman. After reading a book about witchcraft, I was curious and uncertain about occultism, not because of history, but because of the knowledge of these people towards the mysteries of the world. As my life progressed, my passion for sorcery began to flourish. How a simple mixture of substances can change a life is incredible, and so it was. Working as a librarian, I was able to dedicate most of my time to books. Books that hide not only stories, but hard facts to believe. I guess I can't open it. That's it. Okay. I actually made next week starting Sunday insane chat. Sun, Blitz Kid, Wednesday, Friday, Gore. I'm going to be broke and so beat. <laughs> yeah, you'll have a fucking killer time, dude. That sounds like a good fucking week. I'm pretty jealous, not going to lie. Gross. I'm gonna play the piano. Nope. Dicks. He, I tell you, pours the wax out because it's starting to like drip. Clever. Opens the door. You look for the keyhole first. I don't like that one fucking bit. Thank you. Can I just open the door? I guess not. Ooh, the fuck? God damn it. It's fucking cheap. <laughs> I'm trying to open the fucking door and I turn it. Someone was right there. There's a jerk in the box. No. Look at the roaches on the ground. What's this? High strength magnifying glass. How was Scorn? Was thinking about starting it after Deathloop. Um, it, it's it's pretty good for for an adventure game with lots of puzzles. Um, it was fun. I will say. Why can't I take this? I guess I can. Um. It's it's a good game for what it is. Um, if you go in expecting like lots of gunplay and like uh, lots of narration, it's just it's not there. It's not meant to be there. Uh, meanie, you fucking asshole! I thought someone was walking up behind me for a second there. Um, but I enjoyed it. I, I got about six hours out of it. If you have Game Pass, uh, 
play it through Game Pass because it's $35 on Steam. Um, and I just feel like that's that kind of pushes it for six hours. What's going on here? Just readjusted my candle. The way it drips down my hands. Ugh. Fucking absolutely not, sir. Do I have to fucking do this? Like, I don't understand what my job is doing this. Am I a cop or an FBI agent or some shit? Who are you people? Now, which way do we go here? Is the ball get pushed from that way? <laughs> I don't know what that was, but it was loud and it was glass shattering and it scared me. Um, good, I have two more candles. Not doing a good job warding these off with the candles. Fucking scaring me. Fuck was that? Yeah, I love Game Pass. That's how I've been playing Deathloop in the new Plague's Tale. Oh, word. Hello? <laughs> Jesus, fuck. Meanie. Six, man. Can't carry any more candles? Get fucked. I'm leaving that open, man. Look how little this candle has left. Like, just fucking switch it out. Oh, that doesn't open? Wow. No. Jesus. What all this stuff I found that I was reading? I felt like it was going in the right direction. Nope, another candle. Can't pick it up. Well, the drawer opens to know where the candles are. Oh, great, mannequins. And a dead end. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> <laughs> Scared the life out of me. Shit. Dead end. That means I'm about to get jump scared back around this corner, huh? Ooh. Candles toast. Jesus. Alright. Got that cancel. Now let's head back. I know there's another way back here. Scorn's gameplay remedy on the cancel. Hi. Uh that was hysterical timing too with tree knocking on the door. Hi, Daddy. <coughs> Jogs. God. <laughs> How are you, uh, the, well, wait a minute, what time is it? How are you doing at almost lunchtime? Jeez, tree. <laughs> Sus. Another candle I can't pick up. Ooh, what's this? An old book with an eerie cover. I can't read it. Okay. I don't know if you've ever played any chair, but it's an interesting game. Um, I have not. What, uh, what, like, in terms of genre, like, is it a horror? Is it sci fi? Um, <clears throat> glass keeps fucking breaking, and it's like, I don't, I don't like it. It's not fun. A woman. A woman? I wonder if this was Henrietta when she was younger. Never played it. What's it? Yeah. yeah. Uh, oh, um, I'm I'm doing good. I'm doing grand, honestly. My last night of on call, so I'm I'm so excited to just just be able to sleep tonight. Well, hopefully sleep tonight. If I can't sleep tonight, I'm definitely sleeping tomorrow night. It's gonna be awesome. Uh, but otherwise, no complaints. Things are well. Puzzle game, I guess, would be called a sci-fi puzzler. The map works in a fourth-dimensional hypercube style of pathing Ooh, yeah that sounds like fun all right so that's one of the memories right i still have to find the other masks too for a secondary objective cool
Cue some fucking wine right now, my god. Mother of God. <laughs> Another fucking candle. There's so many candles. I mean, which is a good thing. Because apparently you need the candles to keep the evil spirits away. Oh, some wax just fell on the floor and, uh... Yeah, you guessed it. It, it looks like a big old wad of fucking thick jizz. <laughs> Sounds cool, sort of like a PT sci-fi. What the fuck? Stop throwing shit at me. It's not how you treat a guest. We got here. A damaged notebook. Why do I get to pick this up when there's nothing on it? Okay. Nothing else here. What is that? Okay, move it down like halfway through the candle. I guess there's no combat in it and no horror aspect. You feel utter trapped and alone with the exception of this weird blocky smoke monster thing that you see from time to time. That sounds pretty cool. The, uh, there is some combat in Scorn. Um, not a hell of a it lot. It's like a picture enough. of a man, but his face is scratched out. The picture is very damaged. All right, that's two out of three. One more to go, and then we can get the fuck out of here. I don't care about the goddamn masks. The door looks strange. Can I open? Nope. Oh, door's locked. It's actually locked. Interesting. Okay. So I guess we'll head back the way we came. And then back at this break to the left where we came from, we'll keep going straight. I think that sounds reasonable. really dark down here what we got what we got it's the last it's an picture old mansion of some kind this must be the Kedward house all three baby what an interesting object maybe if I turn these pieces oh wait is this timed It just clicks. Okay, I'm just gonna turn as fast as I can here. This is dumb. <laughs> this better not be timed. Do this one first, maybe? I don't understand this puzzle. Come back to that later. I don't like. I don't know what the fuck that was. Maybe I have to find a bit more information to get that puzzle solved. Can I open this door? I cannot. Someone's blocking the door. Fair enough. All right, so I really have nowhere else to go. So this seems like the only thing I can do. It's an old mansion of some kind. This must be the Kedward house. What an interesting object. Maybe if I turn these pieces. Let me go look at the door. 
that I just saw over here? Because maybe the answer. Jesus Christ. Did you say Bagadika? <laughs> oh, the Bagadika. Keep playing those things backwards. They're not creepy at all. <laughs> nope, 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 nope. Alright, so it's not what I was thinking. This door is just very basic looking with like the little twirls. It just I saw the twirly stuff and figured it was related somehow. Alright, we're out of that candle. Is butterflies helpful? No. Shit. Ah! I think I have all these well, I I say like I have all these candles. Not gonna have all of them very long. The way this is going. Alright. Maybe I'll head back this way because you're like supposed to trigger that puzzle or something. Fuck off. Oh yeah, I never got to open this door, but I could look through the keyhole. Like, maybe it'll let me actually try to open it now. No, it doesn't. Is there a puzzle in here that I can tell? No, nothing helpful. There's a treasure chest, though. That looks pretty sick. Hmm. And then the other way is completely dead end back where I started. So yeah, I have a feeling that we just have to do this puzzle somehow some way how pray tell i can't say i'm gonna go lay by the bay i just may there's no books or anything It's an old mansion of some kind. This must be the Kedward house. What an interesting object. Maybe if I turn these pieces... Like, that looks like it connects just fine. That definitely connects. It's timed. Okay, so somehow I need to turn all of these before the time runs out, or not. Okay. Maybe you need to rotate circles in a certain sequence. No, I just had to go quick. Well, oh, I did have the sequence right, I guess. Maybe it'll help me see something. What the hell is hidden on the walls? Oh, that sounds terrible. And that's someone's heart? There must be somewhere I can put Old these. metal heart. You can find the shrine to put the lost photos into? Yikes. Oh, this isn't fun. I don't like this at all. I don't see anything on the walls yet. I'm sure I will soon enough. Shit out of his ball bag. Hell yeah. <laughs> what the fuck was that? How do I light the new candle? Can we 
go. Like it said, press the right arrow, and I I press D because that sends me the right arrow. Fuck sakes, dude. I just want to see if there's anything on the fucking door. Was always yelling at me. No, it's not writing. I thought there was. Right I'm not interested. Fucking boomer music. I'll go this way first. I'm not seeing anything anywhere that's of any use. Going back towards the beginning now. Good old bird. Alright. <laughs> Fuck. Meanie. Dickhead. Thank you for the biddies. Why am I not finding anything that looks helpful? Eh, whatever. It's a book that fell. Oh, it's just that closet. That's just the way that door looks. I thought that was something, but it's just the glare of the fucking uh, candle. Alright. So far, really not finding anything of concern here. Oh my god. That's where the heart goes. What the fuck? I also heard the footsteps. That was terrifying. You bastard. Perfect time because I just found this other candle. Thank you. Okay. So what do we do here? What is this? Salt circle. In every ritual of a spiritual invocation, a magical a magic barrier is created by sprinkling a circle of salt. This serves to protect people from evil entities who cannot cross the barrier. Well, I'm not magical, so we'll just go around through. That seemed easy enough. So am I safe back here? Or am I now entering the area where the things are? Oh my god! Oh god. Alright. Find the shrine to put the lost photos into. Great. That lady freaky. Yeah, she's just standing there. Menacingly. Where are you going? When dreaming, I'm guided to another world. Time and time again at sunrise, I fight to stay asleep, cause I don't want to leave the comfort of this place cause there's a hunger. A longing to escape from the life I live when I'm awake, so let's go there. Let's make our escape, come on. Let's go there, let's ask, can we stay? Can you take me higher, to a place where blind men see? Can you take me higher, to a place with golden streets? Although I would like our world to change. <laughs> wow. Stunning. Alright, so apparently if I run... Oh, it's time, baby! Oh, fucking baloney boy! Welcome in, friendo. Am I not getting the shout out to work automatically? What the fuck? My shit is broken. Give me one second, my dear friend. How was your stream, dude? I saw that you were playing um, Mortuary. What is that then? Oh, it's A1. Huh? Is that how they label them? 
Is this Wait, a back the... rooms? Oh, I guess I wasn't on, on the first floor, technically. Huh? Tried it after the updates. Oh, how was it after the update? Yeah. Ah! <laughs> what the fuck was that? <laughs> what was that, dude? <laughs> Called Housemeister. Oh, God. Looks fucking awful. Uh, we're playing Project Nightmares case 30 something or other Henrietta bitch face. So yeah, for those who have not been here before, welcome in. I am the Juggernaut. I play horror games. Uh, me and Blowny Boy know each other through what, Sane TBD and uh, Channel 13 Horror. So my face may look familiar. There's no fucking way you saw me. No. She's faster than me. My god. Updates are good, still terrifying. Nice. Okay. So this is gonna be a lot more difficult than I thought. I have to find the shrine. Uh, <laughs> got it. <laughs> I gotta figure out where the shrine is back there. And it seems like if I get caught in her field of view, you're basically dead. I escaped her once because I just was able to get back over the line. Shit. Ugh. By the way, for anyone that is um, interested in these types of things, we are doing a charity collection all month long. We call it Jugtober. We raise money for Hope for the Day, which is to combat uh, suicide via awareness and um, proactivity, education. Uh, and uh, something that's near and dear to my heart, and I'm sure other people, it's near, to, uh, near and close to them as well. Oh my god. Nice. Oh, this is so key. Yeah, this is the night, bitch. Me. Pittance for thee, sir. <laughs> Thank you for the pits, dude. All these fucking crosses and none of them work. Unfucking believable. What is this, a brush? Seriously, why am I looking at this? Every time it does that, I get scared. I think I'm about to get attacked by something. All right, I have another candle there. I hit the wrong button. All right, anything around this way? No? All right. What the fuck was that? I mean, it sounded like someone was screaming. I think I just stepped in a cockroach. Yeah, I did. I stepped on two of them. Whoops. Good night, you guys. Glad I caught a stream. Happy October. Oh, thank you, dude. Thank you so much for coming through. Um, if I don't see you before then, uh, can we just see you at Merciful Fate? It's going to be fucking righteous. What the fuck? What the fuck? Isn't that... I'm never gonna dance again, guilty Me? feet. I've got no rhythm, no. It's easy to on? pretend I know what you're not a fool. I should have known better than to cheat a friend. Should have known better, yeah. And waste the chance that I've been given, so I'm never gonna dance again the way Will I, I dance, dance with, with you. you. Oh. Excuse me. Alright, so these are all worthless. Nothing in there. Probably just candles in these things. Yep. And max down candles. Bless! Thank you, Spore. Okay, nothing except for the candle on the top one. The hell with you. Another piano.
open that fucking thing. Nothing? God damn it. Fuck you. Nothing there, nothing down there. Always stick to the right. What is at the end of this hallway? I don't know if I like that. What the? Oh, is this it? Small shrine with room to place pictures. Place the photos in the shrine. Oh, okay, then let me. Can I? Okay. Place the photos in the shrine. Ow. Oh, there we go. Just a small town girl living in a lonely world, she took the midnight train going, going anywhere. anywhere. Just a city boy born and raised in South Detroit, he took the midnight train going anywhere. Salt. A singer in a smoky room, a smell of wine and cheap perfume for a smile they can share. The night it goes on and on and on and on. And don't and stop and believing, and hold on to that feeling. Street lights, people don't stop believing, hold on. Street lights, people. Another diary. What the fuck? Henrietta Kedward's diary, husband. The years went by, and almost by force, I had to fulfill the duty of marriage. An arranged marriage with a wealthy husband it gave me time to devote myself to my passion, although I kept it hidden. He was a man immersed in his work, a man of the world who traveled almost all the time. This helped me to investigate the occult in a unique way, to understand what the world in its darkest times punished, the mysteries of the beyond. But I was not completely alone. A mansion needs its servants. That's how I met Anna. One night I found her looking at one of my books, and I noticed some interest in the subject. Scared by the carelessness, I thought it would be my be my end, but it was not so. With time, we became great friends and allies. The years passed, and I became a connoisseur of the unknown. I was ready for the next step. Thanks to my strange library contacts, I could find the Book of the Dead. I was almost ready to use it. Oh, boy. Girl. Excuse me, bitch. Well done. Good stuff. The machine is giving us the first clues we need. Our scientists picked up a great aura in a room with two windows. Go and investigate what it is. Oh, that's super helpful. Find the symbol in the room with two windows. Yeah, great. I don't even know which which rooms I can even get into. Let alone the ones that have two fucking windows on it. Ignorant. Alright, grab this candle. Nothing there. Another candle, but I can't take it. I think I'll be maxed. Yeah, I'm maxed. Okay. No worries. Leave the drawer open because there's a candle there. I'll be able to see it. Okay. Nothing there. I bet you there's going to be a candle. No, what's this? An ancient golden beetle. Like a scarab? It's kind of cool looking. I don't know why that really matters, but cool. Wow, no candle at that table. Shocked. Fucking mannequins, dude. Cannot stand mannequins. Shut the fuck up. Twelve? There was X11. I saw that. I wonder what that means. Why would they show me 12? What's this? A used drinking gourd? Let's 
check this room. Nice. So this must be the room we need. Hopefully. Alright, so I see that there's one window. Unless they count it as two. Oh. Fucking creepy. Hmm. Nope. Oh yeah, how does this salt thing work? I can't carry any more salt. What does the salt do? That doesn't help. Shit. I don't remember what happened. Is there a sign in here? Oh, okay. That's the actual thing. I was like, damn, look at that. Alright, so this is not the room I need, but candles are kind of, uh, kind of cool, so... What the fuck that was? It's got the chills, though. Just stepped on more bugs. Delicious. Alright, we'll keep heading down this way. But that's weird that that key opened up that door, and there's nothing behind it. Unless it's like a master key. What the hell's up there? Check this stuff first. Okay. Nothing else is selectable here. Right. Oh my god, a candle. What are the odds? Ah, an Ouroboros. There we go. Locked. The door's locked. Ugh. Give me one second. I think I checked this one already. Whatever you say, boss. Literally nothing but a scream, dude. Oh, the beetle. I've already done this. And that's that door I've opened there. Alright, so we've hit all this already. It's a basketball or a little ball got tossed. Okay. Where else can I go now? Cool if I had a map. Uh, there's the shrine. We hit that up already. Maybe it'll open this door? Nope, just uh, checking myself out in the tank. Oh, I keep, keep forgetting to use this glass. Well, monocle. Hmm. Plague control achievement unlocked. Apparently, squishing enough bugs gets you some cool shit. Alright, so I think I have to get to the next spot. So I have to get through this area. I don't know how to throw the salt. Maybe it's in controls.
Nothing about that. I guess I could hit X for inventory. Of one salt. It must be the uh, the right click. All right, come on, hurry it up. I got stuff to do. Thank you. Got things to do, curses to lift. You know the deal. All right, there's another one over here. We're good. Too late. I can only carry one salt, apparently. That's dumb. to tell these areas apart because they all look the fuck the same maybe that's the whole point i don't know right, let's check this door um okay like how do we get the keys to get into these fucking middle rooms that's what i want to know Keep squishing bugs, I'm not even trying to. Hello? Wake up! Wake up, wake up! Nice. So, whoever the witch is, like suicide silence. That's cool. Nope. Bump bump. Bump bump. Bump 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 What's this? Closed jewelry box. Can I open the closed jewelry box? No, we put it back down and it goes back in the drawer. Oh, this one. Okay, bye. Hoping I can get an operator. Guess not. This is not good. <laughs> this is not good. No shit, dude. You signed up for this job without even talking to me first. All right, I was trying to pull the thing up here. All right, nothing here. I think it's just a straight up dead end. Nothing of great importance. Okay. Oh. in there. Oh, so there must be a courtyard in the middle or something. There's a door over there. What's this? Oh. Yeah, put that back down. That is very unsanitary, sir. Right, back to full of candles again. I'm almost positive. Two candles. I thought we could carry three. Maybe it's two and whatever this one's at. What the fuck was that? 
I hope this guy's wigging out. Like, enough stuff has been tossed in front of him. <laughs> That's full. Two more here. Ah, it is a master key. Okay, cool. Can we not gung-ho into the fucking rooms like that, my dude? Jesus Christ. Oh, boy. What the fuck is that? Is that the, the ninth day Arnold Schwarzenegger movie? Okay, what's this? A wooden mask stained with blood. Ooh. Cool. Found one. I don't know what that is, but I'm, it doesn't look appetizing. Ah, fucking all. Anything else over here? I think the whole point of this room was just to get a mask. That is my assumption. Which, hey, that's cool. I ain't, I ain't, <clears throat> ain't ragging on it. So head the opposite way now at the last thing. Yeah, there's a door at the end here. What we got here? Nothing. Handle. Yeah, I'm full. Then nothing. Okay. And nothing. All right. Weird looking little corner totem. Should be able to open this. That master key. Don't... Two windows. This is it. This is where we want to be. Let's investigate. Found it. It's a puzzle. Let's we'll check the rest of the room first. Make sure there's no little gizmos around here I can get. Oh, there's a little uh, candle there. That's nice. Okay. We found the symbol. An old part system. Maybe I can put it together. Dude, can I really have to get time for this shit? It's stupid. Alright, so this looks like it's the bottom. I can't touch the bottom row. So I need to match pieces that look like they should go there. That definitely goes there. That definitely goes there. Bottom right, move to mid left, mid right, middle, middle, top right, down one space. A little late, but thank you. <laughs> Rotate these around. The oh, fuck I can. I always suck at these because I know where they're supposed to go. I'm never late. A wizard arrives precisely when he needs to. Fucker. this like that this has to come down I 
I'm so bad at these. Like, I can see exactly what the picture is supposed to be, but I'm just so bad. to work with either, so it's very difficult. Painful. I'm so sorry, everybody. So close. Mess it all up, fuck it. Eh. Eh. Fuck. Frustrated fucking piss fuck. God damn it. Like, I get it. I, I get the fucking puzzle. I get what it's supposed to look like. Like, let's move the fuck on from it, please. My god. So fucking stupid. We're legit one block away. That... I believe needs to get down to the bottom and then these two move over and then that's it. This is such bullshit. <laughs> oh 
my god, I think I got it. Let's go. Hmm. This painting seems incomplete. Oh, Maybe the if I find the other parts. Pog. I'll find out what all this means. We're detecting a strong energy in the center of the salt circle. You should go and investigate what it is. Be careful. Let's fucking go. Missing parts of the painting right in the fucking middle. Please no. Meanie. Stop being your namesake, please. Fucker. Yep, I was gonna say this candle's about to go out, I can tell. Good, I'll grab this one on the way out. Take it, thank you. You're a fucker. If that glass shatter hadn't happened first to kind of take the edge off, that fucking jerk in the box would have scared me. I have to go this way. So we have to get back to the salt circle. And then basically get to the center of it somehow to find something. Well, there's... Oh, damn it. That's the dead end. God damn it. Thank you for the biddies, sir. Meanie's doing a better job of scaring me this entire game has. Like, the, the field of view... Is definitely really creepy with the by candlelight. So I give him that. I do like that. But like this part here in the middle sucks. I don't know what to fucking do here. Here she comes. Maybe not. Oh, but what? It's like this. Fuck, I forgot. Okay. We got half of them so far. mask shit damn I gotta find the other two
Oh no. Oh, she can't hear me, so that's good. She can only see me. Pieces. Fuck. I don't think there's any more left in that middle area. I'm gonna go and try to stagger those pieces in now. Alright, that was fucking scary. They got me with that one. Goddamn heater. Okay. So now we can go in here. Here we go again. Now we just need to get these two paintings in there. Maybe there's only two. And then they have to go somewhere else to get the other two. Maybe that's it. Maybe that's the secret. Okay. Hey. What the fuck? I guess I just need to start. Well, they say Ouroboros, so I know that there's a door over here that had Ouroboros on it. there and there's nothing of a great importance in there outside of the mask we also found the second mask too out of the total of four in the entire game for the secondary objective so that's fun where are the pictures of these paintings jesus, jesus. Yo, bitch. Tell me yo secrets. There's peace. Oh my god, no. I thought I was done for. Alright, so there may be pieces in the corner, the end corner spots there. Cool. Come on, where are you? You're a dweeb. Come on, go that way. Okay, bye. Already got that one. The other one here. What was the back corner? 
There's not going to be one here. Are you serious? I want to try the other corner now over there. there. Oh, that was close. Oops. Oh! That was fucking terrifying. Her little squeak of the board, and she came flying around the corner. Give me another some more. Oh, so salt is automated then. That's good to know. So give me plenty of time to not fuck that up. Too. This is not good. Oh, come on, dude. All right, let's go get this portrait hung up or painting, whatever. You already got me once with that. Perfect. All right, we got all the pieces to the painting. This thing just kind of like shimmered. Oh, it's just glass, that's why. A piece here, a piece here. Oh, there's a key in the middle of it too. So of course the painting's gonna come to life and I can just take the key. Hmm, seems to be a symbol with a key inside, but it looks, it looks real. Delicious. What the hell was that? Oh my god! You bastard. Oh my god. What the hell was that? She, she looked like a woman in the flesh. Okay. Can I move now? It's not real. It's not real. I literally can't move. There we go. Henrietta Kidward's diary. Anna. Marriage knocked on my door again. Hector was a man without a family and was eager to start ours. This was never my plans, but therefore caused problems for my studies, so I took action on the matter. A woman with my knowledge could easily not get pregnant. After several unsuccessful, unsuccessful attempts, the relationship became colder. It was at that moment when Anna became the most important person in my life. I never thought that I would find love in this way. What I felt for her was stronger than any spell in the world. We became lovers and we shared the occult in every way. Hector continued with his business trips and bad friendships while I continued on my way. But every time he returned, our reunion became rougher, colder, and even violent. After time, I knew I had to do something about it. Uh-oh. Uh-oh, you killed your husband. The great energy has flared up and everything indicates that we are on the right path. Be careful. That evil entity is still active. Our Jeez, scientists report say. that this symbol in the painting is an Ouroboros. It's also found inside the door. Search yeah. it. Oh, perfect. As if all this wasn't enough. All right. Let's find that damn door. I found it before. <laughs> you see, the candlelight is no longer useful. That's not good. Alright, so this one was an Ouroboros. 
Yeah, it was already... That was like the little kitchen room area. Okay. I think I have to go across to that other entry point in the salt circle. I'm pretty sure that's what we have to do. What am I supposed to do? Shit, right behind me or something? Oh shit, she is. Dumbass. I fucking hate this. I don't know how fast she is. Stop. Go away. What the fuck? Thanks, Tree. What am I supposed to fucking do there? None of that really made any sense. So I, was, I know I'm going the right way then, because that happens. I don't know what to do about it. Honestly, I'm just going to look it up. I'm just not, uh, I'm not in love with this game right now anyways. Um, Let's see. I guess we're on part one of their walkthrough. Oh, it's a fucking YouTube video. Fucking, I hate people. Just write it down, for fuck's sakes. And everything is video, 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 video. So I guess I'll just go to YouTube then. You can pause that. Oh, let's see. I think I just found the spot. And if this is the case, we're not doing very well because it took this guy two and a half hours to beat the game, and this is 40 minutes in. We're, uh,. Probably a solid hour. Wait, how'd you get there? What is that? What? Oh, there's that area. Okay. I'm trying to get to the painting. Oh, there's Ouroboros, so not too far off here. Let's see. This must be where it happens here. I hope. Turn red. No. Oh, there it is. Am 
Where did you run to? Oh, you, you have to run into a room and then close the door behind you and it does a mini game. Okay. Kinda dull, but I guess that naturally makes sense. Oh, I never sneeze again. Hey. 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 Oh, boy. Gonna give this another go. So if I come back here, I can close the door. Nice. Okay, we'll make this work. Oh. God, why my nose so fucking congested? I right, do the thing. Come on. Here we go. Don't fuck this up. Don't fuck this up. I didn't fuck it up. Nice. Got him. Whew. All right, cool. Opens the door, standing there. That'd be the funniest fucking thing. Fuck off. This is not good. Still maxed. Okay. At least for now. Right, whatever. There she is. We have to get across. Come on, Ding Dong. Fuck. She didn't even, like, scream. She didn't do her usual shit at all. And I couldn't use salt. Go. Yeah, I'm pretty sure Ouroboros. What the fuck was that? Anonymous. My arch nemesis has returned to the stream. Whoever this anonymous donor of bits is. We welcome you back. Oh, perfect timing. I'm walking past a candle right now. Come on. Thank you. Pocketed. Uh... 
No. How about how about we don't do this? Can you do me a fucking favor? Can you leave? I'm supposed to find the Ouroboros door and you're being you're being a jerk. What the fuck was that? Was? How about is? How am I supposed to I have to get down that way to get to the Ouroboros door. Where where did it put me? Okay. I think I'm good. Like the the concept here is good. I'm digging the concept. But like this is broken. Like the Ouroboros symbol is in this wing. It wasn't in the first wing. It's not in the third. And there's no other way I can go. <sighs> Back to the uh To the workaround that I uh, walked through, I suppose, because that doesn't make any fucking sense. Oh. That makes its way back towards the salt circle. Yep, he sees the same thing I saw. Walked forward, probably dies. What? You seriously have to watch her eyes? That's some corny fucking shit. <laughs> corny motherfucking shit. But, I guess it makes sense. <clears throat> so you can see her where she's looking. Straight ahead. Over here. Yeah, there's a light. Follow her field of view. Go. What? What the fuck, dude? How did I, I did exactly what that guy just did? Hugged the wall and everything. Let me give this one more. If I get fucked over again by this, I think I'm good. So here's the, uh, the husband book that's on the thing here. Okay. So I use that as my, like, my stopping point. And then she'll come looking back. Kill. Made it. 
great. It's a dumb mechanic. That is a different door, so it needs to go this way, I think. Because that door is open, for one. Here's Ouroboros. A book fell. My goodness. So scary. All right. This is the door. Here we go. What the hell is this place? It's like the whole room is alive. Shit. I don't believe it. That's all I need. Henrietta Coward's diary, the end of the beginning. I must confess that Anna's words were always persuasive from the very beginning, as if an angel or a demon spoke sweetly in my sweetly in my ear and forced me to perform the worst atrocities. In 1929, the winter did not give pause. Hector's travels were affected, giving me the necessary time to make a decision about the biggest issue, his life. On a stormy night, Hector resorted to one of his favorite vices, alcohol. The next morning, he was found dead on the ground. The doctor who came to see him said that his heart stopped beating from natural causes, but Anna and I knew very well that it was not so. His untimely demise was from the substance we had poured into his bottle. A great knowledge in alchemy can leave you out of suspicion if one knows the required elements for the job. This is how I went from being a married woman to a wealthy widow, and moreover, to taking back my freedom and having all the time in the world for the occult. Damn. She's got her, she's got her stuff figured out. Investigate the place. Great. Will do. There's also, uh... No scent of light here. Nothing. This, this shit is fucking cursed. What's this? Jacob's letter. Since Kebert got here, strange things are happening in the mansion. These goddamn crows won't give a break. I hunt them, kill them, and they keep coming back. I don't know how, because in 46 years in this town, I never saw one. When I kill them, I see how the lady looks at me with hate. As time goes on, she's acting more strange. At night, I can't sleep. If this keeps up, I'll leave this damn job. Well, I think you should have left a bit earlier. Fucking Christ. This is bullshit. Chest. What the fuck is this? It's like a scarecrow with human parts. This is pure witchcraft. I mean, yeah. We've been there, dude. So that guy's gonna fucking chase us. Jacob's letter. Green this letter, burn that witch. I tried to escape, but she caught me. Suddenly I'm locked up, badly injured. I know there's no way out. Something's up. I can see it on her face. It was a smile of revenge. The only thing I'm sure of is that she's pure evil. Ah, oh, thanks for hanging out, trees. And it's fucking always, dude. Appreciate you. Have a lovely evening. I'm probably not too far behind you. Hmm. <laughs> Ooh, excuse me, I'm not, I'm probably not too much far behind you in the same regard. It seems to be a mural. I like him through the four elements. Okay. I hear someone walking. I don't even know what I'm doing. Oh. 
I'm just gonna try all of them. If I could. What is it doing? An old parchment with a strange symbol. But it doesn't seem like it's paper. Papyrus? The Triskelion key. Oh, I know what that symbol is. I can't really do much in this other thing. No! Where is it? Fuck that. Alright. Honestly, I think this is where I'm going to stop. I think this is a good spot, at least. Um, it's just about 1 a.m. And I've uh, not been taking care of my sleeping habits very well recently. So I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to do that. I'm going to be good to me. Um, I appreciate everybody that came in and hung out and saw some of... Uh, Project Nightmares. Um, I'll probably go back to it at some point. I feel like the game left a lot to be desired. Um, at least so far. But be nice to Jug. That's my friend. <laughs> okay, I guess. Um, so, so, yeah. Um... Uh, let's go find somebody to raid. Um, I think tomorrow, by the way, I'm planning on being back at a, a normal time. I think we'll try doing stay out of the house tomorrow night, which should be fun. Um, let's see. There's a good chunk of people on right now. But um, I like to go and raid Noxler just because of... Um, some of the hardships he's been dealing with. His, uh, his cat is missing currently. And, um, I, I'm sure it's really not doing well in, in, in trying to keep his hopes up. So maybe we can give him a little bit of, uh, a little bit of that jug mob love. We'll head it over that way. Let me get his stream up ready to go. Okay, cool. Oh, and he's and he's wearing my merch. <laughs> cool, awesome. All right, everybody, thank you so much again. Um, having a great time uh, getting through, uh, not getting through, but just living living Jugtober. Uh, we're officially in the Eastern time zone here, the twentieth of October. So we're really heading. We're in that second half. Uh, so I, I'm looking forward to seeing what other milestones we unlock. Again, we have Among Us on Friday, and then we have um, Creature Double Feature on Saturday. So that's going to be fun. Uh, but that's going to be all for today. So let's go ahead and get this raid kicked off. Over to Noxler. Most people that are in this uh, channel often know who Noxler is. And uh, it shouldn't be too difficult to figure out who he is. Uh, but yeah, please go give him some love. He's, um, like I said, he's been having a kind of a rough go of it. So, uh, give him some of that love that I know the drug mob can do. And, uh, I'll be, I'll be back tomorrow more than likely. Yeah. That's it. I'm out. Bye.